there is a website called llamahub.ai where you can find a lot of interesting data set that you can use to create racks or even your small project or if you want to practice on some data set then you can go on this website and you can download those data set and here I am going to show you how you can use a function download llama data set to download any data set that is available on this website first let's go to that website I will copy this URL from here and then I'll paste it here and this is the website llama hub and if you click on this llama data set you will see a lot of options so these are the options so you will see we have this mini covid qa data set llama 2 paper data set and there are so many data set this is ubay 10000 data set 2021 we are going to download this data set here or maybe we can download some other data set as well so let's see how we can download these data set from this llama hub api i'm going to download this blockchain solana because i find this interesting it is related to blockchain so let's go to our website and first i'm going to import download llama data set i will write here from llama underscore index dot core dot llama underscore data set data set and then import download llama data set now i'm going to make a variable two variables first is going to be the name of the data set and second it will create a folder where it will save that data set so i will write variable names first rag underscore data set i'm giving this name rag underscore data set because you can create rag out of these data set or let me just give it a name of data set so that you do not confuse and my second parameter is going to be documents and then I will call this download llama data set inside this I am going to pass this information from the data set that I am going to download so I will click on this blockchain solana and then if I come here it says that I have to pass this data set name like this and then the folder where I want to save it first let me copy this so I will just copy it from here and then I will paste it in double quotes and the second parameter is I have to create a folder like this so I will paste it here instead of data I will give some other name because if I go here you will see that I have a folder name data then I also have a folder name Solana so I will name this folder as Solana underscore new and then I will close this function here let us execute our code now to see how this data set looks like we can convert this into pandas data frame and look at some five rows from this data set so it has loaded i will call this data set and then convert it into pandas and then let's look at five rows i will write here five and then let's execute our code method object is not subs okay i have to call this function here so i have to write like this and then let us execute again and here in the output you can see that 
we have this data set that we loaded and these are the informations that you will find in this data set here so we have this query reference context reference answer reference answer by query by these are the columns that are present in this data set so the purpose of this video was if you want to download data set for some uh, for some tutorials or for learning purpose or for creating a small project you can always come on this Lama Hub AI and here you can come on this section Lama data set and then you can choose any data set that you want to use it from here and you can simply use it. That's all for this tutorial. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.